If from the title you were hoping for a video on me talking about AI making everybody obsolete, well, I'm sorry that flame war has been postponed to a later date and probably another channel. You see, this video is on making your code obsolete. You see, oftentimes we play a little game of chicken when updating our code. Maybe a class is no longer required, or maybe you've added a new function that supersedes the old one that you jotted up in five minutes when under a time crunch. Well, when we make these changes, we can oftentimes simply delete the class or function. Now, if we're in a small team or we're solo, that may be acceptable, and sometimes it's even unavoidable. However, because of time constraints, you may not want to update all the code that uses that old function today, leaving it for a future you problem. But how can we let future you or developers that may use that function know that current you has inspired the change to the code? Well, enter our savior, the obsolete attribute. So here is an example of a function that is being replaced by something shinier. Let's mark that function as obsolete. What happens in our Unity project? Well, as you can see, we get a handy warning telling us the function has been marked obsolete wherever we're calling it from. That's great, but it doesn't give us much information. What's this function been replaced with? And what version will it get removed eventually? Well, luckily you can enter a message within the attribute to let the developer know, as you can see here. And if its obsolescence needs to be raised to a point where the obsolete function must not be used anymore, then we have a last setting, which is the attribute we set to true. And this is to mark it as an error which, as you can see, is reflected in the editor. And of course, the obsolete attribute can be used on the whole class as well. So now, the next time you do a large refactor of your code, you can take it out piece by piece in the knowledge that you have marked up any code that needs removing and you won't forget it. Kind of like I hope you don't forget to add a like to this video. Only if you got anything out of it, of course.